His long search for Siri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman. Roach. Watcher? I see and right. Yes. Got work for me? If you're willing. Some manner of evil prowls about. Got us scared to venture out of the village. Any idea what kind of beast this is? Oh, you hear all sorts of things. The wenches clean the nets, blather about costches and manticores. But I reckon that's hogwash. We'd seek the counsel of Freya's priestesses, we would. But how can we when we can't get to the shrine? And nobody's gotten a glimpse of the beast? From a distance, even? Oh, they have, they have. Right close. Closer than boot and strap. Soon after, their blood spattered the underbrush. Near from the start, no ordinary man could handle the beast. But Svera insisted. Mustered a crew and... Only four came back, the rest massacred east of the village. So, will you help? Let's talk about my reward. You want to bargain? How would you count it? Hating hands at the withers, or...? Hmm, by species. Drowners less than a cockatrice. Aha! Uh -huh. But we've no notion what prowls the high road. What do you say you cut it down and then we'll talk? Mm -mm. We pre-agree a price. Define a bonus for unforeseen risks. Uh, 
So, how much? Ah, have it your way. Tis your neck on the line. I'll tend to the monster. Not your first, that's clear enough. Not like our lads. Heads full of fire, but not a morsel of thought between them. The four survivors, where'll I find them? Aim to talk to Sphere? Maybe it ain't a bad idea. They're sitting over there by that hut. Can I have a word? I serve the goddess and her flock. What can I help? What's with the horseshoes? Those who wish to race in the hero's pursuits hang them there. At a series of races? Hmm. Can outsiders sign up, or is this a closed event? Freya sees no insiders, no outsiders. Any man can pay her tribute by risking his life in the pursuits. Our races differ from those on the continent. We are beholden to one rule alone. First across the line wins. Sometimes he's the swiftest, other times it is the one who knocks his opponents off their mounts. Explains the name. They're an entry fee? Courage. If you do not lack it, hang the horseshoe. Bit of exercise never killed anyone. So, where are the races held? The first three on Ard Skellig. Whoever wins each at least once returns here to Hindusfjall to face last year's best rider in a final pursuit. Gotcha. What's his name? You mean hers. Astrid of Speakerog, known as the Vipers. Lovely as monikers go. And completely deserved. Good luck, Witcher. May your deeds bring the goddess pleasure. Be cursed. did know how to win, friends. I was provoked. Mm-hmm. Saw it happen. Wanted to talk to me about something? Amos Far Ipsis. A specialist on jinns. Heard of him? I found a tome he'd penned in the Emperor's library. Far Ipsis set off for Skelliger one day and was never heard from again. I asked some of the local folk. Some here still remember him. Why are you even interested? Jinns are dangerous sometimes, and malicious all the time. I remember. But the advantages outweigh the risks. If I can tame a Jinn, I shall gain incredible power. And that could be useful to us one of these days. Nowhere to look? For the mage and the Jinn? The locals say they last saw Amos's ship off the coast of Hindusfjall, just before a once in an eon storm broke. Dad will find them then. Mage is probably fish food, and the djinn escaped. Not necessarily. But even if it is so, I'll not give up without seeing some evidence. Will you help me? I've no gold to offer in reward, but I shall be ever so grateful. Since you put it that way, fine. I'll help you. Thank you. A boat awaits in the harbor. Come. Tell me See, you've managed to prepare everything already. I have. How could you possibly know I'd agree? I didn't. Decided to risk it.
lead the way. Just once, you might try to take the initiative. Would you even let me? Wonder if he's as strong as he looks? The ship carrying the djinn sank somewhere in this area. Not too precise as leads go. I'll cast a spell on our boat. We'll know if there are any wrecks on the seafloor below us. All right, let's get to work. Mind if I take the helm? <sighs> I got a choice. No. Getting in or not? Not sure this gin thing's a good idea. We managed to seize one before. Do you remember? Of course. lost his voice that time. <laughs> how lucky your exorcism saved it. It was poetic. Yeah, how was I supposed to know that incantation meant to be gone and plow yourself? You should have studied foreign languages. I'm gonna keep bringing that up for the rest of my life. Of course. Your last wish effectively assured it. My wish was about us being together always, not about you mocking my every mistake. Careful what you wish for. And when your wish is granted, you must accept it with all attendant circumstances. Yeah... And as for your missteps, I don't rightly see why I shouldn't laugh if they're amusing. There's something here, on the bottom. It's too deep here. You can't dive that long. You underestimate me. On the contrary. After all, I asked you for help. I'll cast a spell. It will slow your heart for a time. You can stay submerged longer. Asad, I cried a reborn. Ready. Careful down there. How's it going? Yeah, and you know I hate it when you read my mind. Strictly speaking, I'm not reading your mind, but using telepathy. Besides, you've nothing to hide, right? Wouldn't admit it if I did. Not the point. See anything interesting? A shipwreck in the cavern. I'll look inside. Snapped masts, busted planks, and a whole swarm of drowners. Probably drawn by the corpses of drowned crew, then made their nest here. There's also a Clan Drummond figurehead. Not the right ship. Come back up.
the leads take us. Say we find the djinn, what do we do? Ask for a beautiful house, and a palace, and a queen's crown? Are we still talking about the djinn, or have we moved on to a talking fish? Doesn't much matter. Both make wishes come true. What would yours be? You learn in two things. Something's here. Another wreck. Let's see if our gin's down there. wreck. It's been here a while. Woods are on it. Look around, but be careful. Look for something that might indicate it's the mage's ship. stuck in the side, the kind pharaoh folk use. A death worthy of a Skelliger. Clan emblem indicates a Dimmon man, so he was from Pharaoh. Men from Pharaoh attacked this ship. Yen, 
Doubt any of these boats were the mages. These are old sunken longships. Come back then. We must search elsewhere. better at this. Go even quicker if you helped me down there. I prefer to observe matters from up here, most definitely. Yeah, like when we were looking for the golden dragon and the avalanche swept us off the trail. Me clinging to the remains of a bridge for dear life. You gripping my waist, admiring the view. Remember? The chasm below us was breathtaking. Rustling trees, a lazily flowing stream. I remember. Though I found myself admiring what I had right in front of me. Something strange about those rocks. And there's something on the bottom. I'll see what it is. See something? Something doesn't do it justice. A huge crater, as if a meteorite landed here. I must see it. Diving in after all? No, I shall cast another spell to see through your eyes. Now relax. I see Falchia Badem Ein Eichter Ilivaid. That is no meteorite crater. What is it then? 
the effect of teleportation. A powerful force cut out a fragment of the seabed, rocks and everything lying within the teleportation zone. Always claimed portals were dangerous. I believe we're on the right track. Look for anything that might contain a gin. Fine, but get out of my eyes. Too cramped in here for us both. I see. Silver, pearl encrusted cutlery. Ship belonged to someone awfully wealthy. Amos was no pauper. It could very well be his ship. something you ought to like. What? Half a seal. That'll do. Come back up. Only found half. Can you do anything with this? I can use it to locate the other half, to within a dozen yards. And once we find that, we should find the gin. Exactly. Ready? I'll take us there on the count of three. Oh, no, not another portal. Stop whining. One, two... Three! Said you were gonna go on three. I did. Look, we must search the area. Yen, not so fast. Gotta tell me what this is about first. Why do you want this Jin? But you already know. A Jin's power is priceless to a mage. Won't warm your way out of it. Not this time. Tell me the truth or I'll leave. You needn't resort to blackmail. You would have learned eventually. True, but after the fact. I want to know now. How long has this been going on, Geralt? This thing between us? Fifteen, twenty years? We repeatedly split up, then return to one another. Something draws us to each other, but I can never be certain if it's a true feeling or merely a bit of mischief by a djinn. So that's it. This is about my last wish? You asked that djinn to bind us together forever. I want to ask this one to take that wish back. Why would you want to do that? To see what it's like without it. To see if we'll still matter to one another. Or if we'll be like two strangers. Hmm. Wondered that myself many times. You see, we're just a step away from learning the truth. Come, let's search the ship. Seems Amos was quite the eccentric. Asking the Jinn to lift half his ship to a mountaintop. He didn't necessarily. Jinns are inherently mischievous. This one might have granted his wish and perverted it in doing so. In that case, I'd appreciate it if you didn't wish I'd disappear from your life.
have yet to decide how to word it. We should explore the ship. Nothing interesting. Hmm, nothing interesting here.